Welcome back, this is a short addition to the last video about the Phantom Punch and the mystery surrounding the Ali Liston bouts. If you haven't seen it already, I'd recommend you watch it before this video. We're gonna talk about the question mark surrounding Sonny Liston's life. Strange things altogether they would take place. And yeah, a lot of strange things are in yeah. boxing as as we see here. This is beautiful. The thing would would make a doctorate thesis and I don't know. The the long count. I think in the in the end only only Sunny Liston would hundred percent know what happened here. Yeah. It's the he only man who could who could tell this is what happened and I don't think he ever did publicly. No. We just know that after this he like his whole his whole life then fell apart after this. Yeah. Uh, his boxing career wasn't good. Uh, he didn't get the title fights anymore. Later in this one title fight he had, he got KO'd and he stopped. Was yeah. into trucks or some kind of. Yeah. But then died in mysterious fashion. Yeah. The same way he appears. It's no what a puzzle. Knows. What a puzzle have we here. His previous life doing time in jail in the is there is there, is there any fighter that is more mysterious than listen you, you don't know how old this guy is you don't know about his yeah. birth for sure you don't you're not sure about his birth he becomes champion in a mysterious and uh, nothing like mysterious it's just like a godzilla knocking out what is supposed to be the best guy around like floyd patterson knocks him out no problem two times one round then fights the, the the fight after it fights Muhammad Ali and loses is two times in a strange controversial fa fashion and later on dies in a mysterious way where the facts don't like make a lot of sense and there's a lot of theories what really happened and nobody knows yeah, like I said before, watching videos is a good thing to do. Reading will complete the videos, but talking, this brings up long forgotten uh, things or new ideas. Uh, I'll tell you one. Sonny Listen, if you check his pictures, everybody knows this. He's always the face and he's looking like he's a killer and he's, yeah. he's bad. Maybe yeah. now, after these words you just said, now uh, I thought about it. He had to get into the first league, and maybe he was not. Maybe just a uh, conjecture, abstraction. He created a uh, what we call persona. I have to do have to be or look like something different. So. He was always like this, looking like a, I'm going to kill someone. And it catches your attention. There, there is one or two pictures of his I have seen. He was smiling and he didn't talk much. And well, maybe it, it was just uh, he was in person. Uh, how can I say this? Like an actor. So this was his branding, maybe. I'm just, uh, well, this is what conversations, uh, I cannot talk to a book, so I cannot talk to, to a video. So, well, um, there are registers that after doing time in jail and his involvement with uh, mobsters and his death, uh, well, some people say, he was striving to have a normal life and leave the things behind. So uh, what could he do? He could box. But how do you get into the first league? So maybe uh, the guy was smarter than could ever imagine. And he made this, this persona, this, well, and this thing built uh, and uh, worldwide a character 
that maybe was just a, was just a like a, a movie his private life maybe yes could could well be i can see it well he if it was so if then his branding worked because uh, he's regarded forever like the most uh, scary yeah, if he <laughs> yeah if he was an actor then he would have been a very good one yeah hollywood would be the place for him